Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial of WooCommerce Mobicool Delivery Boy app and in the previous video we showed you how the admin uh, could uh, configure the app in the first place and how the customers can place an order from the uh, web store front end and in today's video tutorial we'll be showing you how the admin and the delivery boys would be able to access their mobile application and how the delivery guys would be able to process uh, an order and how the admin can assign the delivery guy with an order that has been placed within the uh, store itself using the mobile app so let's get ahead and let's see how this can be done so firstly i'll be showing you the admin uh, mobile app uh, end workflow and then the delivery guy mobile end workflow up the uh, mobile device right now so i'll be logging into my mobile device uh, mobile app first so i'll tap and open this particular app now i'll be logging in as uh, the admin so i'll be entering my username and my password and thereafter i'll tap the login button so after a successful login you can see i can see a dashboard right now and uh, at the last we can see the delivery boy status right now so right now we can see that two are offline or two are not two are not using the current app uh, at, at, the, at this time so uh, here you can see the uh, sales graph right now apart from that you can tap on the orders here to check the today weekly monthly orders that have been accordingly placed under the sales we can check today weekly monthly and yearly graph for the same and tapping on these three hor uh, horizontal lines on the left brings up the admin side panel and here we have the dashboard then we have orders delivery boy and chat now let's go through each of them one by one now under the orders the admin would find all of the orders that have been placed um, uh, within the web store so in the previous video I showed you, you the uh, order number that was 3576 that we uh, placed from the web store front end and this is also visible here in the all ones apart from that the admin can see the assigned ones the orders that have already been assigned to different uh, uh, delivery guys Apart from that, under the unassigned, the admin can see the orders which have not yet been assigned to any delivery guy. And here we can see the order number 3576 is also visible here. So now, for example, if the admin wants to assign this order to a particular delivery boy, he can tap on this uh, order number 3576. And here, uh, as we can see that uh, under the top, uh, choose delivery boy option is there. So right now, no uh, delivery boy was assigned. Now we'll tap on that and this would bring up the details complete details uh, of the uh, delivery guys that are available right now and accordingly the admin would be able to assign the order to that particular delivery guy so here uh, for this particular order we have uh, looking at the list of the uh, delivery buys that are right now online so you can see that uh, some of them are uh, indicated with red some with gray so some are not uh, available right now those are the red ones and if any uh, delivery guy is available that would be uh, for his status that would be displayed by a green dot there so now let me uh, again tap on the choose delivery boy here and this would again display the complete list of the uh, uh, delivery boys that are uh, online right now and here we can see that uh, the delivery boy uh, that's the DB mobile uh, is there let me go ahead and let me assign this particular order to this uh, delivery boy so now you can see that the delivery boy DB mobile has been assigned to this particular order apart from that the uh, admin can also enter uh, any comments if you want to set up or enter any comments for the delivery guy so here you can see now under the delivery boy we have the db mobile the delivery guy who has received this particular order for the order number 3576 so now let me go back and uh, that was the order section we pay, uh, we checked the order number 3576 that was placed within the order we have assigned that order to a delivery guy now let's go to the delivery boy section here the admin can view all the delivery boys and can add a new by tapping this uh, plus icon on the bottom right hand corner after that the admin can enable disable this particular delivery boy or can uh, and can enter the name email mobile his vehicle type and uh, the uh, vehicle number and the other information and tap the submit button to create a new delivery boy from the mobile app itself and all that too on the go now uh, let's go back now lastly we have the chat option now here the admin can chat with the delivery boys as well as with the customers 
who are online so the admin can directly uh, tap on any of the uh, delivery guides and can put view the particular chart history as well for them so here you can see that there is chart history so uh, for example let me Please process so that was about the chat section so those are the main sections for the admin and dashboard auto auxiliary boy chat and logout tapping on the logout logs the admin out of the mobile application itself and uh, that was much about the admin end. now let's go and let's see how the uh, delivery boys can manage uh, this uh, order at their end within the mobile device itself so now I'm at the uh, delivery guys uh, mobile end and I'll be logging into the uh, mobile application itself. So I've entered my username and password. So I'll tap the login button so I have to log in. So I need to allow my location for this particular application. And I'll tap on the allow. Now you can see that uh, as soon as the delivery boy logs in, he can see the uh, recent order that he has received. So we had uh, place the order 3576 and now he can accept or cancel this particular order so we'll tap on accept to process this particular order so this was how the uh, delivery guy can accept an order using the mobile app itself and thereafter uh, I'll be now showing you or the request has been processed successfully apart from that uh, the delivery guy can see the, two, uh, the pending, pending orders for today processing orders orders that have been uh, that are being processed and the complete orders as well who are uh, so the orders under the complete orders are those ones that have been delivered to the customer so now under the dashboard of uh, this delivery guy you can see we have option dashboard orders chart and settings so under the dashboard as uh, we know we have the sales and the orders and we have a graph for that that can be uh, uh, filtered using the day uh, like the today weekly monthly and yearly uh, parts and here the uh, delivery boy can see his particular status as well so now let's go to the order section and let's see what we have so here we have the uh, order number 3576 that was placed on the web store and was assigned to this particular delivery boy so what we'll be doing is uh, we'll be going ahead and we'll be processing this uh, particular order so i'll just show you in a moment from now apart from that the uh, delivery guy can chat with the admin for that he needs to tap on the chat and here you can see that uh, the admin had uh, sent uh, the message I have assigned an order now please process that I've just showed you within the uh, admin mobile app so that was about the uh, chat section lastly we have the settings section and here uh, the uh, delivery boy can see his uh, personal details his email his uh, uh, his vehicle number and the type of vehicle apart from that you can tap on this your online button so as to make himself offline if he doesn't want to work right now so he can go offline as well so now let's go to the order section and let me complete this particular order so i'll tap on this particular order so it has been assigned to me so if i want to go to the orbital park uh, that's the uh, customer name is ellen roy and the delivery address i can tap on this arrow uh, uh, that is colored in the red just above the uh, uh, dialer so i can check the uh, location of that person particular customer on the uh, on the on the on the map itself so apart from that i can pick up the order and i reject the order as well so whenever i reach the uh boost or uh, what we say as the physical outlet when i pick the order from that place i'll tap the picked up uh, button here so let me tap on the picked up now on the confirmation let me tap ok so this means that the order has been uh, basically picked up by the delivery guy from the uh, warehouse itself and after picking up all right the order has been picked and here you can see that the order status has changed from accepted to pick pick up now we have the options to reject still reject the order or deliver the order now after uh, navigating to the customer's address by tapping on this uh, google map icon if we tap that on the google map icon we can open it open the particular location uh, using the map itself and uh, by tapping the directions button the uh, delivery guy can reach to the customer's address so let me go back and uh, 
So now after reaching the customer, the delivery boy just needs to tap on the deliver button uh, and we need to collect 30 miles cash. And now here the customer would be giving this particular um, uh, delivery guy with an uh, OTP that was generated there under the uh, my order section for the customer for that particular order. So I'll be entering it now. 221958. Now I'll tap on the proceed button. And what this would do is this would confirm this particular order that the order has been delivered to the uh, respective customer because we took the OTP from the customer himself and this order is not uh, visible to anyone else. So here you can see that the order has been submitted and you can see a tick mark up at the top as well. So uh, now let's tap on the orders. Let me refresh this once. Now you can see that the order number 3576 is complete on the top, right? So uh, after uh, that and lastly we have the logout button so as to log out the uh, the uh, delivery guy from the uh, mobile app itself so that was much about the functionality at the admins and the delivery guys end and uh, i hope it helped you out so that was much about the woocommerce mobi cool delivery boy app and i hope it helped you out if you have any questions or queries regarding this particular mobile app then you can always get back to us at support at the rate of webcool.com or you may raise it again at webcool.uids.com Thanks for watching this video and have a great day ahead.